Well, I left Key West after selling my former gallery. I had been here for mm, more than 10 years at that time, so I took a little break and went to California. And, um, you know, it's a lovely place, but it's not my place. It's not Key West, it's not warm, and it's not really that liberal. <laughs> I came back to Key West to create the Key West Art Bar, which has been a dream for quite some time, to make a truly interactive happening space that is um, respectful and inclusive of all kinds of the arts and creativity as well as people of all echelons. You don't have to be rich to come here and you're not going to get pressured to buy something and then leave. Here at the Art Bar, we love all kinds of creativity, so the works featured here will include everything from literary arts to metalwork to major sculpture, known artists as well as unknown artists. We are including uh, independent films, performances, um, classes, you name it. If it's creative, it's going on at the Art Bar in Key West. The Art Bar features work by artists um, primarily local and those items range from jewelry a small sculpture. I represent over the course of a year easily a hundred jewelry artists. We believe that jewelry is small sculpture. We have what's called the Jewelry Bar and it is fabulous. It's a place where the girls can come and hunt and peck and really get personal attention and choose from an incredible variety of fabulous gems from pretty exotic and hard to find to um, just special for you. Gosh, there's just, there's just so much, as well as metal work, um, amazing ceramics, paintings, Lon Michaels, uh, oh my gosh, it's just amazing. We have a really good mix, like I say, of known and unknown artists. We choose by quality first, although Florida and local artists do get preference, we believe that quality is more important than geography. Like I said, this is about being um, a happening space where people can come and enjoy the arts and interact with other artists and really get involved. I looked at every possible location on the island, and this is, hands down, this is the only place that this could have happened. It's large and beautiful, for one, with the 20-foot ceilings. There really is nowhere else on the island that this could have happened, not to mention the location is perfect. The Key West Art Bar is located at 901 Caroline Street in the CAD, which is the Caroline Street Art and Design District, where you can get all the best and most unique goods on the island. Um, we're right here in the historic seaport at the Bight, most conveniently located to everything and surrounded by parking. So next time you're in Key West, come and meet me at the Art Bar.